Biggest bass I ever caught. Respect Outdoors, presented by Steiner Binoculars. Nothing escapes these eyes. Also brought to you by Burris Optics. See the light. Set lock, get close, go undetected. Also brought to you by Big Lake Lodge. Come fish in our backyard. Warning. You are about to watch an outdoor television show. A show that is specifically designed and produced for people just like us. Everyday working people who love the outdoors. How y'all like that? Hi, I'm Robert Arrington, and I would like you to meet a good friend of mine, Jason Robertson. He's 26 years old and lives in Sumter, South Carolina. A couple years back, he had a bump on the inside of his leg, so he went to the doctor to have it checked out. At first, they thought it was a hairline fracture, but after the results from the biopsy came back, the dreadful news was delivered. That bump was cancer. Immediately, they amputated his leg and over the next eight months, he endured round after round of intense chemotherapy. But then, like a new day, he was in remission. The next year, each month, he and his mom, Kimberly, would return to the doctor where he would get checked up. And the doctor's news every time was like a bright new day, free and clear. The second year, the checkups went to every three months and the doctor said that if he could go for two years in remission, he would likely never see that cancer again. Unfortunately, on his very last visit, he received news that would buckle even the sturdiest of knees. The cancer was back. The news was horrible, terminal cancer, a cancer only God can cure. Well, Jason's resolve was to live, live each day to the fullest and as if it were his last. He'd always dreamed of killing a big buck and getting to host his very own TV show. So I present to you, Jason Robertson, host of Respect Outdoors, as he celebrates life. six yards. Tells you the range so you know how far you're shooting. My name is Jason Robertson. Everybody calls me Jason. I like to hunt and fish. Just hang out. I think they were that, in that group over there, there's one with horns too. As soon as we went through the gate, there was deer in the field and running around everywhere. It was a real nice place and I knew we were gonna have a lot of fun.
As most of you know, the Burris Eliminator Laser Scope is the most advanced rifle scope on the market today. But did you know that it's also the best possible muzzle loader and slug gun scope as well? Simple and easy to mount and quickly calibrated in just minutes. You can easily extend the effective range of your muzzle loader or slug gun out to 300 yards. Just range them and eliminate them. Top your slug gun or muzzle loader with the new Burris Eliminator Laser Scope and you'll become a better and more efficient hunter. Hey everybody, welcome back to Respect Outdoors. This segment is brought to you by Scentlock. I define success by getting to take a picture with a big buck at the end of a hunt. And the number one key to getting that done is eliminating my scent. I do that using a successful scent lock method. Head cover, gloves, coveralls, rubber boots, and my base layers. Hey folks, on your next hunt, get yourself a set of scent lock, take care of it, and it'll take care of you. I'm Jason Robertson, and you're watching Respect Outdoors. My name is Kimberly West, and I'm Jason Robertson's mother. That's my baby gorilla. We were stalking through the woods, and you know, Jason has the prosthetic. And they're like, can you walk some? He was like, oh, yes. I mean, that's him, Mr. You know, he is. He's very tough. He handles things very well. Well, we thought we were going to walk just a little ways, but we walked a long ways. But it was OK. He stuck with it. But I was hanging behind as a mama watching. <laughs> well, I liked it, but it's kind of, it'll wear you out stalking the deer and all that. So we had to go a good little ways. Stalking that big axis deer, that was a lot of fun. But I've never got to kill anything that big. Good shot. Perfect Good shot. shot. <laughs> Smoked him. Great shot, dude. I was worried because when you stopped him, man, when Chris stopped him, yeah. I, I didn't know if you knew we wanted you to shoot. I didn't know if y'all wanted me to yet or not. And I didn't, I didn't even have time to do the range thing. <laughs> I just had to take him. That's been a blast. Funnest thing I've ever done. Good shot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's textbook there. Good job, that worked man. perfect, man. Good deal, good deal, good deal. This hasn't been easy. We've walked about a mile so far. <laughs> but we told him if he's coming hunting with respect outdoors, he's going to earn it. There he is. That's 
awesome. Thank y'all so much. I know he's tickled to death. <laughs> That's totally awesome. Chris, I appreciate you bringing us out, no taking care of everything. They had a big Mexican night planned at the at the lodge, and I said, you know what? Let's skip the whole Mexican night and have backstrap night. It was a lot of fun for sure, huh? Yeah, it was a blast. <laughs> you know, tomorrow's not promised to none of us. You gotta live every day like it's your last, and your memories will last forever. This one certainly will. Yep. I know you're watching a hunting and fishing show, but if you wanna go on a hunting or fishing trip, and go with an outfitter or guide that won't let you down. I've been all over the world and I've hunted with some of the best and some of the worst. So let my experience help you. If you'd like to come down here to Florida and go on a wild hog hunt or an alligator hunt with me and film it too, shoot me an email, robert at respectoutdoors.com. I guarantee you I'll put you on a good trip. We heading out to the lake to try to catch some fish. He said they've been catching a bunch of them. I'm hoping to catch one bigger than I've ever caught before. That'd make me real happy. At least four pounds. I'd like to catch one eight or nine now. We went on the guide thing and it was amazing. I've never caught fish like that before. And they were big. My mom caught a nice one. <laughs> Mine's bigger. <laughs> uh, that one's still bigger. All right, it's on, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> what you think, buddy? Let's do that bass. I like it. It's a nice one. Well, the deal was, <laughs> if I caught the biggest fish, Jason would have to raise the four younger children for the next four years. <laughs> but if he caught the bigger fish, oh, yeah. I would have to go for the next round of chemo. When you ready, start chemo, Mom. I think Monday got All right. Just making sure you was ready. It's another good one. I'm having a blast out here fishing with these shiners. Couldn't be a better day for fishing. What you got on here, Jason? A big bass. Oh yeah, that's five or six. <laughs> they keep them away from the boat. <laughs> Reel down to him just a little bit. There you go, buddy. <laughs> Look at the mouth on that sucker. Yes, Jason, you gotta grab a hold yeah, of him. You gotta hold him. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's the biggest bass I ever caught.
baby. Jason, you ready for four kids? Nope. <laughs> Yeah! Reel down. Reel down. There we go. Yeah! Yeah, baby! And that's an eight or nine pounder there. Holy Heck dude. yeah! What a I know he's over eight. Have you had a good time so far? I had a great time. Yeah. How's it been spending time with your mom here? It's been real fun. Yeah. What's been your favorite thing you've done with your mom so far? Watch her catch that big bass today. Uh, we about to scare my mama. Alright, come on in here. We'll get the sheets off this bed. Made a mess. I'll tell you what. Ah! <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Y'all got me. Y'all got me good. <laughs> You're watching Respect Outdoors. We'll be right back. <laughs> Hey everybody and welcome back to Respect Outdoors. This segment is brought to you by the Burris Eliminator Facebook fan page. This is the all new revolutionary laser range finding bullet drop compensating scope made by Burris, an American made company for the American outdoorsman. Hey folks, we've been giving away free hunts, giving away new scopes, shirts, hats, you name it. All you've gotta do is become a fan of the page and you're instantly entered to win. We'll see you there. It's the Burris Eliminator Facebook fan page. You know where I can find any hogs? You got any around here? <laughs> Just because you're hosting the show does not mean you're immune to missing a big hog on camera. We had forgot the bog pod shooting sticks back at camp, so we had to make do with these flimsy shooting sticks that we rubber band together, and the sticks just didn't do. He shot low. No big deal. I'm not upset one bit because now I don't have to clean that big stinking nasty boar hog. No harm, no foul. Let's head back to the camp and get ready to cook that big axis buck. Bring the bell, folks. It's game time. Now we're about to eat him. Yeah, I know. <laughs> My plan was to grill the loins and fry the back straps. Serve it with a little yellow rice, corn, and some milk gravy with onions. That's what I'm talking about. It was an immediate bond between him and Jason. They just hit it off from the first moment. Buggy's real cool. 
They said, hey, you want to drive it? He gets in the seat and drives it. And that's how he is. And that's how he's handled his cancer. I think I'm going to go home and change my truck into one. <laughs> I just want to thank everyone who had anything to do with this at all. I even want to thank Palmetto Health Children's Hospital that got me in touch with Brad Jones, that got me in touch with Danny San Angelo, that got in touch with Robert Arrington, that put all these people in our path. They take good care of my son at that hospital. And I want to thank everyone that had anything to do with this. You have showed my son the best time of his life. He has a new friend. Just, he didn't just have an adventure. He has a new friend. Some things you can buy, some things you can't. This was priceless. Meeting Jason and Kimberly has been amazing but it's also been a real eye-opener for me. I've made memories with them that will last forever. And only God knows why bad things happen to good people. But I know whom I believed, and I am persuaded that he is able to keep that which I have committed unto him against that day. Jason, I love you like a brother, and I wish I could take your pain. Godspeed, my brother. I'll see you.